Listen, um, if you can get in on this, I would do it as quickly as possible. This is our uh, embassy. This is what we call the super slim microcut shredder. This thing is amazing. I've, this is the first time I've ever presented this before. First of all, the profile on this, take a look, and I'm going to turn it to the side really quickly so you can see. Look at how slim that profile is. Most of your shredders are about this big. This one does every bit of the same amount of work, but it does it in a real slim design. So if you are, uh, you know, in a place that's kind of a tight space, you can uh, accommodate this very, very easily. It's the lowest price we've ever done on this slim cut shredder we took ten dollars off the price it's 119.95 uh, it's quite expensive to ship out because it is a substantial item those gears that chop everything up are very heavy uh, we're going to take care of the shipping for you and it's only four payments uh, of 29.99 for the holiday weekend uh, as i said it's you know this time of year especially you need to have one of these it's tax time um, you're going to be putting together all kinds of documents everything that may have vital information that could get in the hands of the wrong people so and if you don't think there are people out there well here's some of the common ways that that identity theft happens. What we call dumpster diving. You know, people just hanging out, looking around, trying to find stuff, going through your stuff, uh, skimming, fishing, changing your address, old-fashioned stealing. They have uh, so many different ways and opportunities to get their hands on your very, very private information. The key to getting rid of it is the microcut technology. You put it in here. It's, it's what we call cross-cut. It doesn't just do the strips and shreds. It does that, then it cuts them in individual teeny tiny pieces, thousands of pieces per sheet of paper. Eight sheet capacity inside here. It'll actually go through your uh, your regular size staples and it'll get rid of old credit cards that's another way that people can find your old information your old documentation it has a just about a four gallon bin on this and it shreds very very quickly as I said before uh, all these features are loaded into it auto stock on start it's got a manual reverse just in case anything gets jammed you can back it out it won't overheat on you and it comes with the tax act 2014 software is it the 2014 or 2013? For the year 2013, <laughs> right? It says 2014, but it means for 2000. It should be 2013. Mel Duggan <laughs> is here with everybody. He's going to show you how it works. I, I have owned a shredder. Mm -hmm. I have owned a shredder for probably about six, seven years. Well, you have Best to. investment I ever made because I get rid of all the clutter. I get rid of all the Everything. flyers, the mailers, real estate people, all that stuff. Not Your Valentine's. Pay. Not that there's anything wrong with real estate people, but, you know, I'm constantly hammered for people wanting to put your house on the market, all that stuff. Flyers, right? We get so much stuff sent to our homes, and we can't prevent what comes to our homes, but we're prepared with this because this design, I mean... Think about that. You have investment planning information, those pre-filled out credit card applications, social security information, your tax documents. It is tax season. That's why you're getting that tax act software. And, you know, if we add a staple or two, I'm going to put this in. This says eight sheets at a time. It's from Embassy. What's the best part about Embassy? Look, it's not even going in properly. It's taking care of it. Embassy makes one in four shredders on the market. They know what we need. They know what we like. That's why this design, it's unique to HSN in terms of how it's a smaller profile. Again, tax documents, all this stuff, we cannot just throw it away. We have to do it smartly. And you might be like, what is microcut technology? I want to show you what microcut is. Here's a little history lesson. Here's that strip shred technology, 31 shreds per page. We've all been there and done that. And then we actually had to progress away to that, to cross cutting, which we've heard of. Cross cutting is definitely better, but people can put this together if they want your information. And strip shreds and cross cut, that's all you find at the box stores. Micro cutting, look at this. This is thousands of shreds mm -hmm. per page. Confetti. That is security yeah. and peace of mind because they can't put it back together. And that's what you want. So you notice we've done credit cards, we've done staples, we do eight sheets at a time. And because Embassy makes one in four shredders on the market, and by the way, every Embassy shredder we brought here at HSN, a customer, customer pick. picks. Yeah. Shoppers here love it because you get so much more. So you notice right here, I put in eight by 10 pieces of paper. When the day is done, I don't take the whole machine over to the garbage bin. I have this great four gallon pretty much pull out canister right down here. So you see right down in the front, I pull out this canister, I take this to the garbage can. And you see inside there, that's our micro cut shred. Look at that security. Look at how small these pieces are. So I'm gonna show you right now. I'm gonna take one piece and I want you to see micro cutting in action. Eight by 10 goes in. What do you get on the other side? You get micro cut technology. Look at that, Look at how Bill. small those pieces are. That is security in peace yeah. of mind. One in 10 <laughs> of us fall victims to identity you, theft. You're never gonna put that back together, no. ever. All right, now if it's the strips, remember the famous movie came out last right. year or the year before um, and the, guy, the kids were, were we're using the strips to try to find the people. You know the movie is called Argo. Anyway, I don't care. I'm just going to say it because it's a great movie. Um, but anyway, um, that's how they did it. And, and if you don't think people do that today, there are people that their full-time job is trying to steal other people's identity. Right. Because once they do it, it's a very hard crime to trace. Uh, because once you find out about it, so much damage has already been done. 
Uh, our own Marlo Smith, who's one of our hosts here, I know she went through a, a nightmare. Two years ago, she had her identity stolen. Still sword, dealing with it. And that's just it. To yeah. this day, she still has to unfreeze her credit. And one of the best parts about this design, she notices it stands a little taller. It stands about 24 inches tall. Why is that great? You're not constantly bending down. It's right there on the edge of your desk. It's really slim and low profile. I'm going to go show you how slim and effective that is. That's why Embassy, again, has thought of everything. And you just think of this, too. It's that micro-cut technology. You're getting that tax act software which is a great added value because we have to file our taxes it's it is the 2014 version for your last year's taxes yes. state and federal taxes and guess what after a few years yes you get to throw away those taxes after seven years but guess what you can't just throw it away because your social security number is the exact same yep. your account numbers are still the same maybe your address you have to dispose of that information properly and the best way to do it is with a shredder i even have valentine's here i can't even just throw away your valentine's because guess what your address is on there yeah. your first name is on there maybe <clears throat> your nickname <laughs> Maybe your maiden name. Which you is don't a realize how much information, and, and, and if you think it's just certain information that they can track you down with, you're wrong. Names, addresses, it's all links in the chain to be able to find out who you are, where you live, and then from that point on, now they can scout out your house, and if you happen to throw one document away that has a phone number, or a social security number, or a credit card number on it, and it happens all the time, then you're in trouble. What I love, too, about this is the fact that you don't have to put in the papers straight away. You can put them in on an angle, I'll just get it started here and watch. So I can go one this way, I can go one that way. It doesn't matter. It is that powerful that it just chews it right up, doesn't care. And it can be paper, it can be old credit cards. Check this out. Stick your old credit cards in there. It chews those up just as easily, puts them right in here. I'll do two sheets at a time. And look at that. Never an issue. $119.95 is the lowest price ever. We're doing it with free shipping. And if you look at the shipping, shipping's $14.95 on this because this thing is heavy duty. The gears that are in here are very, very heavy because they have to go through metal, they have to go through plastic, and they have to go through stacks of paper. So all I can encourage you to do is buy it. What I do, and I told Bill this, what I do with mine is, mine is uh, right underneath, I've got a little uh, bar area in my house and it's right in the corner next to my printer. And what do I, what I do is I, every day when I get the mail, and it's always on, you, you realize you can leave it on all the time because it's, uh, it's automatically activated so there's no uh, power uh, loss while you keep it on, it's just in the ready position. And what I do is I go to the mailbox and I check out what's in there and if there's junk mail, the junk mail goes right in the unit itself. I never even, and I know when it's junk mail, if it's got a thing that says current resident on it, I'm like, yeah, okay, <laughs> you don't know who I am. Yeah, I have no idea. So, so I'm like, that's impersonal. I'm not even going to answer that one. Right. All right, so Bill, what do you got going on over there, buddy? Well, we've all been there. We just keep stacks and stacks of papers like, I'm going to get around to shredding. You notice the design? Where's the shredder? It fits so discreetly into your home office. It stands taller than your average shredder because guess what? You're sitting at your desk. You're printing off all these forms for tax season. I'm not bending down. The shredder is right there. It's slim. It's low profile. But it stands tall enough where I'm not bending down oh, and pulling awesome. the shredder out. Yeah. I can conveniently just feed the shredder. And you'll notice, look at how slim and low profile it is. That's the shredder right there. It's slick. That white is awesome. At the end of the day, this is what I take to the garbage bin when I want to empty it out. It's that convenient. I put it right back in when it's empty. And it, again, it slits. It's like right there. Where is that shredder? We actually were having these out here. People are like, is that an, a humidifier? Is that a, oh, an air purifier? No, it's that shredder, which is going to protect yeah. you and your family. Look how it, and look how it snugs up right against the important? desk like that. And that's I love so that. important because yep. it takes up less space, yet you're going to be able to use it. Because maybe you do keep this in your front hall or kitchen when you come in and you get all of that mail. And that's, again, why Embassy is a leader in the industry. One in four shredders on the market. Every shredder that Embassy brings us at HSN is a customer pick. And they think of all those designs that we appreciate. And the fact that our shopper goes online to brag about a shredder just shows you that peace of mind of what they get. One in 10 of us fall victims to identity theft. The FTC recommends we have a shredder to protect ourselves, to protect our information that comes in the tax documents and investment planning, medical records, paycheck stubs. This statistic actually, guys, scared me the most because they say the most susceptible to identity theft are kids. Yeah. Because, you know, they have social security numbers. Well, and, they're, and they're a little careless. Well, that's just They it. can be. I know when I was in college, I had a credit card. You kidding me? Sometimes I'd be like, hey, has anybody seen my credit card, right? Mm -hmm. You leave that stuff laying around, and that's what can happen to you. Here, I've got six, seven sheets in a row. Perfect. I put them all in there at the same time on an Let's angle, and it still works. You know, I think this is one of those things, Bill, a lot of people, they say, well, it'll never happen to me. You will be surprised at how many people have to deal with identity theft, and if this simple step, and, and here's another thing. Every major successful and minor successful or even unsuccessful 
Business is out there. Use shredders. They have mm -hmm. to use them to protect their identity. They have to use them to get rid of stuff that they don't want other companies to see. They don't want other hands to see, other eyes to see. Obviously, it's a way to be able to protect yourself. And if all those companies are doing it because they realize the importance of it, you need to do it for your home and for your family. Every day, I'll, I'll guarantee you, probably once a week you get an offer for a credit card, right? Mm -hmm. And in there, I may not have your other credit card information, but it's got your address. It may have resources in there you don't want other people to see. Bank statements, right? Mm -hmm. You don't think people have weight. Nowadays, with, with, they can read your number through your wallet in your pants, so it, they really can. That's your, so yeah. when you think about stuff like that, how hard is it for them to walk outside when you put your stuff on the curb? And that's the other thing. We take our garbage and we put it like 50 feet away from our house. At 6 o'clock in the morning or 5 in the morning, you don't think somebody can walk out there, grab a bag, go home, have their cup of coffee and go, hey, look, there's Mr. Johnson's phone number. Mm -hmm. There's his, hey, look, it's an old credit card. That's, he forgot to shred it. They're recycling. They are, yeah, in <laughs> a bad is, way. You see them out there they're and you bad think they're recyclers, recycling though. their aluminum. They might be recycling your information because it's as simple as just disposing of this properly. Yes, we've all done it. We throw it away. And then what happens? Maybe it's a raccoon. Maybe it's that windstorm blows over your, your garbage can. Yeah. What's in your neighbor's yard? What would you rather have in your neighbor's yard? Rather have micro-cut technology, this secure, nice, tight shred, or say it's this piece of paper. And your neighbor's like, what is this? Oh, it's Guy Van's tax information. Hey. And look what happens when you take this 8x10 piece of paper. I'm going to take this one piece, and you're going to see what comes out on the other end. This is that security and that peace of mind. Yeah, look at how is. small those pieces are. I mean, you couldn't even try to cut that up if you tried to. And that's, again, why you're getting free shipping handling. That's a huge savings, because you have to have muscle and power to go through mm -hmm. a credit card, to go through your staples, to go through eight sheets at a time. There's there's another example over here. I want to show the credit card example right here. Yeah. Because this, again, shows and speaks to the power. We've all had a credit card. We try to get rid of it. How do we do it? We try to bend it really fast and heat it up. Cut it with scissors, scissors, which is hard. Yeah. Look at how small these pieces are. That is what you get with micro cutting. I couldn't even cut them up that small, but your machine can do that. That's why Embassy is a leader. That's why all the Embassy shredders here are customer picks. And there's only about, if you like the white, Paul, how many left? 300 in the white? Oh. Is that what you said to me? All right, so only 300 left in the white. We got 30 seconds left on the clock. All I'm going to tell you, and, and not to mention, uh, again, and for, or fail to mention, the tax tax software, this stuff is great. This is going to enable you to do your own taxes online. And whether you have an easy uh, tax situation or a difficult one, this works on both. And, and this is a voucher, and it's got your own number on the back. You type it in, and these folks will help you mm -hmm. out. And it's state yeah. and federal, so that's yeah, great. Both. And what I yeah. love, too, about when you do it with the tax tax software, you also will notice it starts to actually add up your refund, so you see what you're getting back right away, which always makes it a little easier doing your taxes because guess what all this information if you don't have it already it's a coming you want to make sure you store it or dispose of it properly yep all right listen guys we are just about out of time the price break is the lowest price we've ever done on this and i'm telling you it's going to make your life easy if for no other reason the good thing it'll protect your identity you're going to get rid of clutter a lot of that clutter that's in your house is stacked up piles of bills and stuff you don't know bill you'll be back at 5 p.m thank you all right stick around <laughs> Clearance, lowest price ever on a Dyson vacuum. Coming up next.